also, women have to deal with menopause. Do you know that men have a similar medical condition called andropause? We'll talk to one nationally acclaimed doctor and talk about his new book coming up. Good morning, Arizona. Good morning, Arizona. Welcome back, everyone. You know, I think we've all heard of menopause, the life, the change of life in women. But did you know that also men go through a similar medical condition, and it's called andropause, and it's often misunderstood, many times just ignored. And that's why we have Dr. Gino Tatera joining us this morning to help us understand a little bit more about this male Im hormone imbalance and also to tell us about a free lecture where you can get questions answered. Good morning. Thanks for being here. How are you? Very good, thank you. I've heard of andropause before, not real familiar with it. What exactly is it? Andropause is the male counterpart to female menopause. Men, by the time they hit their late 40s, early 50s, have lost 50% of their, maybe even 60% mm -hmm. of their capability of producing testosterone. So if your level was at the low end of normal when everything was well, by the time you hit 50 or 60 and you've lost half of that, you're really becoming you know, testosterone deficient and it has a marked impact on your life. And some doctors at one point didn't even believe there was such a condition, but that's changing now with uh, the more evidence that you guys find. What are some of the symptoms uh, if a man is going through andropause? If you're going through andropause, you know, one of the first things that you, know, you may start noticing is that you have a marked decrease in your energy base. And even though you're, you know, you've not done anything different, you don't have the energy, which then also results in things such as decreased sex drive, uh, inability to profit from exor uh, exercise, not recovering from exercise. Mm -hmm. You get moody, you get anxious because your brain can't produce serotonin. You have a, a real problem with you know, short-term memory. You become forgetful, you, you live with a foggy brain, and your body, after a while, because of this decreased metabolism, starts adding fat, especially around the middle. And where men are calling it beer gut, it's not really a beer gut. It's, <laughs> We've heard that excuse. Yeah, exactly. Okay, interesting. And what age is this usually happening at? Well, I'm seeing men, you know, coming in that are, you know, having testosterone deficiency, you know, much younger than we think they would. We, we have, you know, my youngest patient is 17 years old. Oh, no, that, yeah, really? He, yes, he's 17 years old. And... But we now are seeing men in their in their 30s, uh, and we have a few, you know, some in their 20s that are actually coming in, and they have you know because of whatever has caused it, no testosterone. Wow. No, you um, are also the author of a couple of books, Life Regained, and you don't have to live with it. What? How does someone get help if they think they're going through these issues? Well, you need to find someone, uh, a physician who is actually interested in making you better. Okay. And who knows how to interpret the lab work? Not just you know, not just saying that it's in the normal range. We have to understand that there is a portion uh, of our body that needs to function at a level, you know, where we were when we were fine. And that means you have to have testosterone levels that are, were the same as you were when you were in your early 30s. And if you're just saying, "Oh, that's okay for your age," then you need to find someone, uh, another physician, who understands that. You may be at 50 years old, you have a level of 350, but really you were doing your best when it was 800. And that's where you and need to be, to be normal. Okay. Absolutely. And how does, okay, I have to be honest with you because I think a lot of guys might be in denial. They hear this, oh gosh, that's, you know, I'm not, I'm not going through that. And maybe they're, the female in their life is noticing these changes. How does one approach a guy to talk about this topic? Well, I think that it's through a, a, a position of saying, I really care for you mm -hmm. and I see these things going on and I really want you to get this check because I think that you're, you know, that you may need, you know, some testosterone because I heard a doctor on the air or I read <laughs> something that, you know, that makes me sound that your symptoms that you're going through are exactly what's in this article or what he was talking about. Mm -hmm. And I think you need to get it checked and be sure that, you know, that that person then gets directed toward the proper person to take care of them. And it's using HRT just like in women. Well, it's Similar? using testosterone therapy. You know, both men and women make the same testosterone, but mm -hmm. you need bioidentical testosterone and you need a method of delivery like we have in which the body actually controls the release of the hormone and the therapy is individualized to your particular needs. And unfortunately, a lot of people aren't getting that kind of therapy. You need to be 
have a dosage that's right for you. Sure, everybody, everybody's different, absolutely. You now, you are holding a seminar later on this month because we could be talking about this topic for a while, but fortunately we're out of time. Tell us about your free lecture that you'll be doing over at the Capitol Grill. Uh, we're going to be doing a lecture for both men and women uh, who are, you know, who suspect they may have hormonal deficiency and are looking for the proper answer. It's a Tuesday, the end of the month, August 31st, at the Capitol Grill between 5.30 and 7 p.m., and I think you've got the phone number up yep. you know, on the screen for us okay and they can call that and make a reservation and we'd love to see them all right well we'll put a hot a link to our hotline on azfamily.com and where are your books available life regained and you don't have to live with it well they can order from our website sodapellytherapy.com or they can also go to amazon it's on okay. there all right thank you very much dr tatera we sure appreciate your time and spreading more awareness on andropause i appreciate it thank you still ahead